Welcome to another Tech Help Quick Tip video brought to you by AccessLearningZone.com. I am your instructor, Richard Rost. Once a week, I'm going to be presenting a new keyboard shortcut tip. Don't try to learn them all at once. There's tons of them. It can be overwhelming. Just learn one new shortcut each week to gradually increase your skill set and your productivity. Today's shortcut key is using the Alt key for ribbon navigation. If you're like me, sometimes while you're working and you're typing stuff in at the keyboard, you're, you're in a session of data entry, you don't want to stop and break your rhythm sometimes and grab the mouse. Or, personally me, I got some carpal tunnel going on in my elbow. So I like to use the mouse as little as possible, especially since I use it all day long. So that's why one of the reasons why I'm doing this keyboard shortcut series because A, I like to use them, and B, there's lots of them I don't even know, so I'm teaching myself. But one thing you can do if you don't like using the mouse is you can use the Alt key to navigate through the ribbon and get to pretty much any command you want, even if the command that you like doesn't have its own pre-built shortcut key. Like some of the ones are easy, like cut, copy, and paste, right? Control X, Control C. Some of them aren't quite so easy. So let's say here I'm on my customer form. I'm going to get rid of the mouse. Slide it right over there. I'm not, not going to want to use it. All right, and I can tab through the fields and do my data entry. Let's say I'm sitting here on last name and I want to sort by last name, okay? I don't want to touch the mouse. So the first thing you do is you press the Alt key on the keyboard. Just press it and release it. Now you'll see a bunch of little labels pop up above the ribbon, okay? You can use those to go anywhere you want. So yeah, you kind of have to know where the buttons are that you like. So I know the Sort option is on the Home tab. So I'm going to go Home, H. Now you can see a new set of labels pop up. And now I want to sort by last name ascending. So I'm going to click the E key. There we go. And now it's sorted my last names ascending. Want to go somewhere else? Just hit the Alt key. You can see all the different options there. You want to go to the Create menu. Go to C. See that? You can pick any of those. Some of the ones on here have two letters. That means you press them in succession, not at the same time. So if you want to create a table, for example, it'd be T and then N. And they do that because, see how there's two T's there? So now I'll press N and I'm creating a table. See that? Control F4 to close a window inside of Access. So Control F4. I haven't covered that one yet. That's a sneak preview. Okay. Want to go somewhere else? Alt. And then how about external data? X. Okay. If you don't want to be here now, hit Escape. Back out. There you go. Back out again. Okay. Escape always backs you up. Alt. And you can see there's numbers up there for anything on your quick launch toolbar across the top there. All right. So two, for example, would be undo for me. One would be save. All right, I'll hit Escape. And that is how you navigate through the ribbon commands, all of them pretty much, using the keyboard. So that's it, nice and quick, right? The keyboard shortcut key videos are supposed to be quick. Just learn one a week, I'm telling you. Learn one a week. Don't try to watch them all. All right, go through, do one a week. That way they'll stick in your brain. Now start using that, okay? I'll see you next week.